Hey guys, so this is going to be a Walmart and Target haul. I'm going to show you guys the Walmart stuff first. I actually still have another Walmart haul that I need to upload. I filmed it, I think, day before yesterday. So when I'm done filming this Walmart and Target haul, I will upload the last Walmart haul and then this one. So I went to Target last night with my grandma, and I went to Walmart this morning to get the money back for these sweats that I'm wearing right now. They're these ones. They're like a wool material. They've got this black print on them, and they have like a black elastic waist with bright neon pink drawstrings and then black elastic around the ankles. I actually showed these to you guys like in a previous Walmart haul. So like I said, they double charged me for these, and I finally got the money back for one pair of them. And while I was there, they had to review the cameras, obviously, to make sure I wasn't just trying to scam them. So I walked around and picked up some stuff in Walmart. This was one of the things. It's the Lighted Shimmer Bulb Garland. It's in the Holiday Time brand, and it was only $9.94. It's 4.16 feet. It's got 10 mini light bulbs, 5 suction cups, and no assembly required. You just plug it in. I thought it was super cute. They also had these in snowflakes, but the snowflakes were just white, like they didn't have any blue on them. And I like the colorful stuff to go outside. I think it stands out more. So yeah, I thought this was super cute and a really good price. I got these little sweatpants, which, well not little, but they're actually pretty big. I thought they were super cute, really soft. The pants that I'm wearing right now, these ones, like I said, they're like a wool material. These remind me of like a cotton and polyester mixed. So it's got like this gray with like the charcoal kind of like faded into it. It's got the black elastic waistband with the drawstrings. It's got this adorable love on the side. And then the ankles are the same thing as the ones I'm wearing. They've got the black elastic ankles. And let me look at what these are made out of, like the material. So these are 67% rayon, 29% polyester, and 4% spandex. So these are actually kind of stretchy. You've got a little bit of room to stretch in them if you like those kind of pants. Plus, they're super soft. And these were $12.88. So I thought that was a good price for these. Super comfy and really cute. I also got from Walmart, you guys... I fell in freaking love with this little long sleeve shirt, you guys. It's really lightweight, so you're not going to be, like, sweating in it. It's not going to feel too heavy, and it's really adorable, you guys. I freaking love it, and it was super cheap. I think it was, like, $12 or $14. Let me see. Where's the price tag? Where the heck is the price tag? I know there's a price tag on it somewhere. Hold on a second. I'll show it to you first. So tell me this is not adorable. It's got the Marilyn Monroe on the front. I love the red lips with the black and white. She's got her red fingernails, and then it says Marilyn Monroe in red. And then look at the long sleeves, you guys. It's got these two stripes on the long sleeves. I just thought that made it look even cuter. And then look, the tag says, look at my back. So when you turn it around... This is so cute. It's like kind of like a jersey. It says Monroe 26. And that's what these stripes remind me of. I fell in love with this. And the price on this is also $12.88. An awesome price for a shirt like this. I actually think this would be super cute with the sweats right there. I think with the black elastic and then the stripes, it would be really, really cute. I then got a second pair of these. I already showed these to you guys. I got them for my brother Jacob, but I got him like an extra large, I think. These are a small 7-8. They're $4.97. I so was hoping to find them with red plaid, but did not find them. These are for Robert because every year for Christmas, I do like kind of like a gift box type thing and I wrap it or a bag or a basket, and I do Christmas PJs, new slippers, a Christmas movie, and then, like, a cute mug, a tumbler, and I put, like, hot chocolate in it. Like, they have really these cute 
And I don't know why I didn't get them. They're only a dollar a piece. They're like little stuffer hot chocolates. And they've all got cute little pictures on the outside with ri little bows made out of ribbon on the top. I should have grabbed a couple of them to put in his little gift box or basket thing. So these are the slippers that'll go in there. And then I bought him a pair of Christmas PJs last night at Target that I'll show you when I do the Target haul next in the same video. And I need to still pick out a Christmas movie and like hot chocolate packs to go in there and a cute little mug or tumbler for him. So I let him open that on Christmas Eve so he can wake up and open his presents and his Christmas jammies and he can fall asleep to a Christmas movie. Then I got two of these Arm & Hammer Spin Brush toothbrushes. I thought these were an awesome deal, you guys. They were only $5. They had a couple different prints, and then they had just solid colors. I wanted to get a different one for Jordan and a different one for Robert so they didn't get them mixed up, but I didn't want any of the solid colors for them. I didn't like them. I liked the ones with the print, and these were the only ones that I felt could go for a guy. So they can just keep them separate. They usually don't keep their toothbrushes close anyways. We have two bathrooms. So this is, like I said, the Arm & Hammer brand. It's got the soft bristles on there. It says spin brush. It says limited edition. Remove 70% more plaque. Design series. And it says color wear with bristles. Remind you to change your brush head every three months. And yeah, so I just thought those were a great price for a spinning brush because I like the ones that actually spin instead of just vibrating. I don't feel like the, you know, when the handle just vibrates, I don't feel like that does anything. I like when it actually moves. So $5 for one of these is just amazing to me. I know I've went on and on about it, but just because I think it's such a good deal. Then I had showed Jordan, I showed you guys the other little Pepsi pack of the lip balms that I got for Robert that he picked out. Jordan said he would actually like a pack of those, but he wanted Mountain Dew. I could not find the Mountain Dew, but I did find another Pepsi pack, but it's not identical to the one I got Robert. Robert's came in like a little box. It was still 4 dollars but his only had five chapsticks, and it had a little like Pepsi necklace thing that you could stick them into. I got this one for Jordan, so they don't have the identical ones, and this one came with six instead of five, and I don't think Jordan would wear the necklace thing anyways. I think that's more for like a kid, so I know he'll like this. Like I said, four eighty eight. It's the party pack. You could actually buy this and separate them and do one for each stuffer or whatever if you have multiple kids. It comes with all the flavored bombs. This one's regular Pepsi. This one's Diet Pepsi. Wild Cherry. Pepsi Max. So there's two of the Wild Cherries. And then my favorite, which I will probably steal, the Cherry Vanilla Pepsi. So I thought that was pretty cool for Jordan. I got this for Jordan, which I thought was super nice. It is this really huge... I love the... Uh, really huge face watches. So I think this is just going to look really like nice on him. He's going to look handsome when he wears it. It's got the really big face. It's got the blue um, in between the colors. And then it's got the blue minute and second hand. It also comes with this little, I don't know, it's like a man bracelet. I don't think Jordan will wear it. But um, I thought about maybe taking that out and giving that to my baby brother because my baby brother might wear that. See, it just looks like that. It's like just a little leather band. But then I thought, I don't know, maybe just keep it together and let Jordan decide. I don't think he'd wear it, but I do like the watch. I thought it was a really good price. I think it was ten eighty eight. I believe, is how much I paid for this. Yeah, I know I paid ten eighty eight for this. Ten eighty eight, or yeah, there we go. Ten eighty eight, right there. They had a couple different ones. I was really tossed up in between this one and one that the band was like kind of a really shiny like gunmetal charcoal color and the face was smaller, but I decided I liked this one with the big face on it. Me and Jordan have really expensive matching Movado watches and then we have another matching set. I forget the brand, um, but they're not huge like this one, so... I know he'll like that as a Christmas gift. 
I got this for as a stuffer for Jordan because he did say he wanted the Mountain Dew chapsticks. I couldn't find the set, but I did find this one. It's in the Lotta Love brand, and they sell these chapsticks at Dollar Tree. Not this specific one, but the Lotta Love brand. I've actually hauled them before. So this is the Mountain Dew Live Wire. It was only a dollar, and it's the flavored lip balm. It's 0 0.15 ounces, so I thought that'd be cute as a stuffer for him. Let's see. I think, is that everything that I got from Walmart? Watch, I guarantee you I'll leave something out, because I do every time, you guys. Every stinking time I film a video, I leave something out, and then I have to film a second video. So I'm going to show you guys the stuff that I got at Target now. I did get some stuff at the Target dollar spot, and then I got some regular stuff as well. I'm going to show you these first, but they are dirty on the bottom because I wore them this morning. And then I spilt freaking coffee on them, so I don't want to set them down. I got these really cute little, They see the gold, it looks like glittery. It's got the shimmery gold in it. They had another pair, you guys, that I wanted so bad. The outside looked all furry, like the inside of these boots. And it was a little bit darker than this, kind of almost like a light brown fur. The outside was all fluffy, but I was like, those will get dirty so fast. I believe these were $24.99. It's got the black with the white, and then look at that beautiful gold that kind of sparkles in the light. It's got the two little foo-foo furry balls on the side with the little ribbon and then the bottom I don't even want to show you the bottom because it's probably so dirty for me I wore these outside yeah look at that that's disgusting but they've got the hard soles on them so you can wear them outside I was like walking at Walmart there was leaves and all that but it's got the hard thick soles so you can not only wear them as slippers but just I wore them with these little sweats they matched really good and yeah so like I said $24.99 they had a couple different pairs in these that were similar and I was really tossed up on which ones to get. I might go back and get the furry ones too. Just for like in the house. So I got those at Target. I got this. We needed laundry soap. And I've used the liquid arm and hammer before. This was $5.19. Which I thought was an awesome deal for the arm and hammer. Like I said I've used it before. This one has the OxyClean in it. The Stain Fighters. It's in the fresh scent. It says it does 47 loads and it is 82.25 fluid ounces, which is a lot for $5.19. or five dollars nineteen cents. It's for all machines, so it's the HE, which is the high efficiency, and it's the 30% more. I think they had these in the same size in like two different ones, and I chose the OxyClean one. I don't normally buy Arm & Hammer, but I didn't want to get like tied at Target because... If I get tied or gain or anything like that, I like to get it at Walmart. It's cheaper. So I just decided to go with this one that's on sale. Jordan? Hold on. Jordan, don't come out here. Sorry, you guys. I have Christmas presents out and Jordan's just walking out here. Jordan. Sorry, guys. Um. So then I got this little pack of toilet paper. And the only reason I got this as well is because we were completely out. This is the dupe to the Scott, and I paid $3.26 for this. And it's got 411.1 square feet of toilet paper. They're really thick rolls. I almost got an 8-pack, but the 8-pack had less square feet than this little 4-pack. So I thought the price was awesome. It's 1,000 sheets per roll. It's in the Up and Up brand, and yeah, I just thought it was a good price for the amount. It is thinner because it's like the Scott, but I thought it was a good deal. I got this Cookies for Santa plate, even though I already have a glass one. This was in the dollar section, or the dollar spot. It's got the dollar price tag on the back. I thought this one was adorable. They had like four different types of cookie plates for Santa, and I thought this was the cutest like I said, even though I already have a glass plate, I couldn't pass that up for a dollar. I also have one placemat that I got at Target last year, and it's black, and it has right cursive writing, and it says Cookies for Santa, and then you put the Cookies for Santa plate on top of it. I got Robert this double pack of wrestlers. This was, 
I think $20 and 99, it was either $20 and 99 cents or $24. He basically has every wrestler, but I don't know if he has these ones and these outfits. It's the Zeb Coulter and Jack Swagger. It comes with an American flag. So I've already gotten him two wrestlers for Christmas and it's just harder for me to get them now because he basically has them all. So they did put out some new ones with new outfits, though, for Christmas. I was excited about that. I have more Target dollar spot, too, you guys. It's just in the other bag. I got these Christmas PJs for Robert. I wasn't able to get, like, an actual set that came together because I couldn't find his size. So I got these plaid Circo pajama pants for him. And they were $10.99. I got him the large, which is $12.14. These are going to fit him, but they're going to be a little bit snug. I would rather have went with the 16s, but they didn't have them. So I think these are really cute and really Christmassy. Like I said, they're going to go with these slippers from Walmart that I got for $4.97. And these have the blue and the plaid too. And then they had a Mickey Mouse shirt in red that looked so cute. And it would have matched perfectly, but when I asked Robert on the phone if he'd rather have Minions or Mickey Mouse, he said Minions. So, I went with this Minion shirt, and like I said, this didn't come together. So, and plus the Mickey Mouse t-shirt was just a little bit smaller than this one. It's got the two Minions, it's in this bright red, it's got the mistletoe, and then it says awkward, and it's just got the little Minion. So, I think he's going to look so cute and these little plaid Christmassy pajama pants with the Christmas shirt and his little slippers. So I also had a robe in the cart. It was black with the gray like tie and me and my grandma were thinking about getting the iron on Raiders emblem for the back. I might still do that, but I'm not sure. I got for my coffee bar that is still not all the way completed. I got these wooden straws. And they've got the little chalkboard labels on them. I thought that was really cute to stick in like the gold cup. And these were a dollar in the dollar spot. You can personalize them. I got these wooden straws with the little Christmas trees. Because in the coffee bar right now that I made, I have my white pitcher with the gold... Going around the edge and the handle, I have these really pretty red poinsettias in it. So I thought these Christmas trees for now would be cute in the gold cup. Just to make it look kind of Christmassy and festive. I got these in the Target dollar spot. It's the four fabric tags. And it comes with one that says all is calm, all is bright. Or actually I think two. It shows you what they come with. One says peace, love, and joy. Well, actually, two of them do. One's in red, one's in gray, and then the one I just read in red and gray, so I, or silver. I thought these were really pretty to, like, hang on gift bags or whatever. I got this at the Target dollar spot. It's this really cute list pad. It's got 40 sheets. It's got the really pretty mint green, and it says, Hello Holidays with the gold polka dots. And then I got the matching pins that are also mint green with the kind of plaid or whatever gold and the polka dots. I just thought that was super cute. I might keep this for myself or friend mail. I'm not sure. So both a dollar each. I got both of these in the dollar spot. These were a dollar. There's like lint on them. These are in the kind of mint green. And they've got the cute little snowman on them with the gray toe and then the gray around the top i just thought they were really cute and then i got this pair for a dollar and these have the little christmas gnomes with this little i don't know they look like santa hats but that's just the hats gnomes wear it's got the red toe the pink heel and then the red around the top tell me those are not super super cute for christmas especially for a dollar each and they're both in the adult 9 to 11 so those will definitely fit my big foot. And then the last thing that I got was just nothing special. A pack of Bounce. It's in the HE. It's the Outdoor Fresh. 
the bounce smells amazing. Before I started using the blue snuggle sheets or Suavitel from Dollar Tree or Gain, I used to always use bounce, but bounce is kind of pricey. I believe I paid $2.22 for 34 of the sheets. The only reason I didn't get the snuggle is because the snuggle came in much bigger boxes and it was way more expensive. So I, I this is the first time I think I've ever ran out of fabric sheets and I might even have some in the hallway closet. I just haven't dug through and looked, but just in case I like to stay st you know have this stuff back stocked anyway. So I got that and I believe that is everything that I got. Hopefully I didn't leave anything out. If I did, I will do a separate video like I always do. I hope you guys are having a fabulous week, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.